Now we're going to head down to Bay County. We start beachside to much improved teams. Bay and Arnold meeting up at Gavlak Stadium. Let's see if the Marlins could snap their six game losing streak to those tornadoes. A new era for Arnold. Former Bozeman coach Jason Griffin taking over the program right off the bat. You can see a sense of renewed energy. Opening drive, they force a Bay turnover on downs. A swarm of Marlins in the backfield. The offense looking sharp too. Junior Will Cotter dropping back and he tosses a deep ball to Darren Elder. He's going to come down with it inside the Tornado's red zone, but they'll eventually be stopped. So start of the second quarter, a huge momentum swing as Bay's punting near their own goal line. It's snapped, rolls out the back of the end zone. It's a safety. That's Arnold's first lead in two seasons. We'll try to add to that total. Cotter picks up the fumble snap, makes a man miss. He takes off down the Bay sideline for a huge chunk of yardage. Finally corralled out around the 25 yard line and looking to strike. Cotter calls his own number again. He's on the run near the 10 yard line when Tamarion Davis rips the ball out. The Tornadoes recover. Now we got a new quarterback in for Bay High. Zay Morgan scrambles outside of the pocket looking for a man deep down the field. He hurls up a prayer which somehow ends in the hands of Randy Moss. I mean, Joaquin Waters, excuse me there. First and 10 Bay High. The Tornadoes will end up turning the ball over and we go into the half with a two to nothing score. It's a defensive battle in the second half. Both teams scoring once and the safety will make the difference. Eight to seven. Arnold is the final score. They win for the first time since November 2022.